promise. Um, nagpalit ako ng pantulog. And, I didn't even welcome Iben. Iben yung sinabi ko. Hindi ko man lang sinabi. <laughs> welcome back to another vlog. I look so rough. So, second day na ng simbang gabi, baby girls. And, as per usual, hindi ako natulog. Kasi na, natatakot akong hindi ako ma ano, magising. Wow. <laughs> Grabe yung hindi magising, no? Pero, yun ba? Yung hindi ako magising, so hindi ako makapunta ng ano, simbang gabi. It's 3.15 a.m. Uh, probably, nagisingan ko si Janet in a while. Okay, so hindi na ako magme-makeup. Actually, parang meron pang konting cheek tint na tira. Magpa-powder lang ako konti. Um, this chair is so noisy. Um, gusto kong i-try itong bagong lip and... I don't know. It's something new from Vice Cosmetics. Gusto ko siyang i-try. Kasi, wala lang. And medyo dry yung aking lips today. Um, this is the Vice Cosmetics Phenomenal Velvet Liquid Lip Kit. Um, sabi dito may naka... Well, sabi dito may laman siya na Velvet Liquid Lipstick and Retractable Lip Liner. Natry ko yung liquid lipstick nila na una nilang nilabas. I didn't really like it that much. Naroon akong review din about that. You can search Vice Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick Philin Ina. And lalabas na yung aking review. Sabi dito, it's ultra soft, cloud-like, and hydrating. I think I got this for 245 pesos or 295. Bakit ito lang masibo? Bice. Introducing a new kind of ganda. Indulge your lips in this vibrant and velvety formula that melts into your lips, leaving them looking healthy and feeling comfy. For a more precise look, pair it with a soft glide lip liner. Um, this one is paraben-free, cruelty-free, bonga, and it's good 24 months after opening. Okay, so yung liquid lipstick contains 3ml of the product, which I think is a good amount, and yung lip liner contains 25 grams. Do not put under direct sunlight. Okay, so first things first, the packaging is lovely. The big yells, like, two, less than 300 pesos lang to, pero ang ganda-ganda ng packaging niya. Oh, by the way, yung kinuha kong shade is Kumela Vu. Nandito yung shade. Like, kung ibibigay mo to as a gift, parang bonggang bonggang bongga na siya as in. I really, really like it. Especially kung bibigay mo siya as a gift na lahat ng shades ibibigay mo. Mm. Pero napansin ko, some shades look very similar on me. Like, meron akong gusto na shade. This one and another one, they look super similar on me. Tapos, parang secured yung products inside. Hindi siya yung maalog-alog ng over. Kasi merong pa ganito. Oh. I like the packaging. Ayan. It's very millennial in fairness. Tapos yung um, indicator niya ng shade. Um, dito ako medyo sad kasi as you can see ayan. It's only a sticker. Tapos hindi pa siya maganda pagka lapat dyan. So, parang matatanggal lang siya. And then, kapag natanggal na siya, parang kailangan ko pa siyang buksan and tignan ko ano yung shade niya para malaman ko kung <laughs> ito ba yung gusto kong suotin. Wait, gigisingin ko nga si Kenneth kasi maingay siya. Umihilik. Black lang siya. Plastic. Tapos, this one feels a little bit like metal. Pero parang plastic din siya. And then, yung kaibahan sa noon na lip liner and sa bago is, this one is retractable so bonga. Parang natatakot ako. Ganyan yun siya. Pero, okay, madali naman siyang sumulat. In fairness, try natin diin na ng konti. Okay, so far, hindi naman siya nababali, thankfully. So, yan yung lip liner ng shade na Kumela Vu. Okay. Packaging is also very secure. Like, it's a snap talaga siya when you close it. See? The liquid lipstick is parang new, new wish, new wish. Packaging din siya kasi parang uh, frosted glass yung itsura niya. <laughs> I like this packaging na frosted glass kasi parang mas social siya tignan. Right, so you get a doe foot applicator. As you can see. Wala akong maamoy sa kanya. Parang wala siya masyadong scent. And iswatch natin siya right here. Okay, 
So, parang mas dark yung liquid lipstick compared sa lip liner. That's weird. Diba dapat mas dark yung lip liner compared sa lipstick? Fairness, sa packaging, sa feel ng product, I'm liking it so far. Presyo, gusto ko siya. Availability, I like it as well. So now, let's move on sa pinaka-important na part. Ang application and ang wear test. And kung comfortable ba siya sa lips. Okay. Let's start with the lip liner. In fairness, ha, super familiar yung itsura niya. Kasi meron ako nitong mga EB Matte lip liners. And it looks so freaking, so freaking similar. Like even the tip. Parang same manufacturer lang sila. So far, madali naman siya sumulat sa lips. Ayan, there we go. So I've lined my lips and hindi naman siya naputol. Thankfully, unlike dun sa mga old um, lip liners, super daling maputol. Nakakaloka. Madali lang naman siyang mag-glide on sa lips. Very soft and creamy. Uh, meron lang konting tugging, pero... Mura lang siya and I think okay na okay yung quality niya for the price like it exceeded my expectations. So now let's move on to the velvet liquid lipstick nila. Mm -hmm. Ooh, napaka pigmented niya. One swipe goodness. Like tignan niya. Oh? Hindi ko to binalik sa tube to get more product. Parang I feel the need to go over the lip liner kasi iba yung kulay niya sa lipstick. Mas light. Okay sana kung a little darker pero iba yung style ni Vice Cosmetics. Pero nung in-apply ko na siya sa lips, baby girls, it feels very like hydrating, soft, smooth. Parang it feels like a cloud. It reminds me of this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. Pero definitely mas pigmented it too. Like one swipe goodness siya. Ito kasi hindi masyado. And this one is a little bit streaky for me. First impressions, I really like how this lipstick looks like. Gustong gusto ko yung itsura niya, baby girls. Oh, closer look. Like it doesn't make my lips look dehydrated. Parang plump pa sila tignan. I really liking it. I don't feel that this is going to be transfer proof. Pero yung look niya sa lips ko, parang creamy matte or powder matte na lipstick. Yun nun. Tapos, nagaganyan mo pa yung lips mo. Yun nun ba? I really like it. Okay, so it's been 5 minutes since I applied this on my lips. And kung magda-dry siya, it should be dry as of now. So, let's see kung transfer proof ba siya. I have some coffee in here. Nope. Hindi talaga siya transfer proof, baby girls. So, kakain ako ng tinapay. And I'm gonna have some coffee. And then, let's see kung may matira pa sa lipstick ko. Okay, so update. Pagkatapos natin uminom ng kape and kumain ng tinapay na medyo malaki. No? So, mm, yan talaga. Um, ito na yung itsura ng ating lips. Medyo natanggal siya dito sa inner part. So, ah, Sorry. Hindi talaga siya long lasting and hindi siya transfer proof. So, kailangan mo siyang dalhin sa ibang bag para mag retouch pagkatapos kumain. And then, um, yung sa ibang, kung si tawag ani, yung sa ibang pagkain, ah, sa ibang lipstick, kapag kumain ka na may transfer. After a while, wala nang transfer. Ito, meron talaga all the time. Hindi mawawala ang kanyang pagka not transfer proof. Tapos, madali din siya ang kumalat. Kasi nga, it's so velvety. So, ingat-ingat kayo dito. Especially kung messy kayo kumain. Madali siyang kumalat. So, I think that's the reason why meron siyang lip liner. Para hindi siya mag-bleed outside your lip line. Actually, pwede, pwede nga mo. <laughs> Actually, pwede ako hindi mag-retouch. Uh, Isispread ko lang yung lipstick on my lips. Like so known. Okay, so magbibis lang si Kenneth and then magsisimba na kami. Hi, baby girls! Tapos na ang mass. It's sunny outside already. Hi, guys. <laughs> si Santa. He's hanging on for dear life. Okay, so alas 6 na ngayon and tignan na yung lipstick. Wala na. 
Kumain ako ng quick quick doon sa simbahan tsaka tempura. Tapos. <sighs> Bilis lang yan matanggal. Try natin mag reapply ulit. This time, medyo manipis na lang yung gagawin ko. There we go. Fresh new layer. And then, kakain kami ng breakfast. Kasi bumili kami ng puto. Puto! 15 pieces. Yung 5 para sa office mate niya. Kasi nagpabili. And then, meron din tayong Masi, my favorite. And dalawang, ay tatlong bibingka. Yung Masi, 5 pesos each. Yung bibingka, 3 for 20 pesos. 7 pesos for each. <laughs> 7 pesos for each. Yung puto ay 5 pesos each. Mahal no. Lima ba yung timan ni Sauna? Mahal daw ang, I don't know, inflation rate. Alright. And then, may binigay na package. Tada! Tignan natin anong laman. Just gonna open it like this. The, the barbarian way. Ah, okay. It's our Altea box. Yay! Ooh. Exciting. Okay, I think I'm gonna do a separate video for this one kasi... Ay, hindi. Parang konti lang naman ang laman nito, Bebe Yell. So, let's do this. Altea unboxing pala ito. So, kapag may pink na plastic, alam mo na, galing sa Altea yan. Yan. Here it is. Ooh, kayo una makakakita anong laman. Anong laman? Okay. Merong pa-card muna. Ayan siya. <laughs> so exciting. Okay. So inside, nakikita ko merong dalawang things inside. <laughs> Ayan. Okay. Let's open it up. Two things, but I'm so excited kasi parang pabango siya, no? And you know, I love pabango. Yee! Exciting, baby girls! Nakakalag. Let's see what we got. First, let's do the perfume. Kasi, you know, I love mga pabango. I love perfumes. So, this one is the Stay Fresh Body Sparkling Mist by TT Kamal. Kilala niyo ba siya? Sikat siya na ano eh, na... Um, celebrity sa Indonesia. So, bongga to! Binigyan nila kami nitong kanilang collaboration na fragrance with TT Kamal. Buksan natin siya. Ooh, I'm excited! Sa packaging, makikita mo na parang floral scent siya. Stay Fresh Body Sparkling Mist. This one contains 100 ml and it's good 12 months after opening. Oh, it smells so fresh! Parang bagong ligo lang yung smell niya. Bango! I love it. Okay, so this is gonna be my new everyday scent. Yeah, I don't really see that much glitter. So that's good. Hindi chunky yung kanyang glitter. Hindi siya yung obnoxious na floral scent. Kasi hindi din ako mahilig sa mga ganun yung parang over-over na floral. Ito, tamang-tama lang. Pa-sweet, pa-virgin na floral scent. Ang bango niya! Perfect for the daytime. I love it. Yes. Thank you so much, Althea Korea. Next up, we have dun dun dun, this one right here. This is the Pore Purifying Serum Cleanser. pH Balancing Mint Extract Pore Care and Deep Cleansing. 150 ml ang laman nito. I need to check sa Althea website kung para saan ito. Pero it looks like this. Ayan, as you can see. Ayan siya. Ooh, pero parang toner yung itsura niya. I don't know. Tingnan natin sa website nila. I'm very happy about these items, baby girls. Yee. And also, mag-update ako about this lipstick later na lang din. I think itong vlog natin is medyo mahaba na siya. Nakakaloka. And again, ito ang nangyari. Wala na naman siya. Ang bilis matanggal. Ba't ganun? Ang bilis niya matanggal. Siguro kasi mahilig ako maganin. Kung lipstick ba? Balik ko yung matang ito. Siguro, you can use the lip liner all over your lips. Tapos, 
patungan mo siya ng lipstick. I don't know. But sad. Hindi ako, I mean, no, hindi ako kumain. Pero, siguro hindi lang talaga siya long-lasting. Ayun. Anyway, kumakain na si Kenneth na aming breakfast. Makakatulog na ako later. So, ayun. Babu! Ay, oh! <laughs> Hi, baby girls. It's the next day. Ingay nung fun. Um, so I don't think I was really clear in my video. Gusto ko lang to clear up na I did not like this new. Anyway, as I was saying, I did not like this new Vice um, Phenomenal Velvet Liquid Lip Kit. Kasi wala lang parang marami pang mas maganda and like yung bullet lipsticks like from Maybelline like this one right here example this one is very affordable it's called the creamy matte lip color 165 lang to like it stays on longer than that phenomenal velvet liquid lipstick hindi ko talaga siya nagustuhan kasi ang bilis niyang matanggal sa lips kahit na like hindi ka kumain or minom natatanggal na siya so I did not like it. I would not recommend it. Nagustuhan ko yung lip liner niya kasi medyo long lasting. So, I think ito na lang yung gagamitin ko. Sayang. But anyway, ayun, I just wanted to clarify kasi parang hindi klaro yung aking review. Ayun. So, that's it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed watching and hope to see you in the next one. Baboo! <laughs>